Hey, Mayor Johnson and other city leaders are going to be meeting to celebrate the groundbreaking of 120 new affordable apartments. So those apartments are going in on South Tacoma Street. And that's where Fox 31's Courtney Fromm is joining us live this morning with more. Good morning, Courtney. Good morning to you both. Yeah, we're over here in South Tacoma. Like you said, it's the Overland neighborhood. We kind of drove around for a bit this morning trying to figure out where that groundbreaking is going to happen at 10 a.m. We think it's right here on this lot here behind us, this big old fence with the private property signs, and we believe that's where that apartment complex is going to go up. Now, we understand there'll be in total 128 income-restricted rental units with 60 of those being supportive housing units and 68 workforce units for people experiencing homelessness and exiting the justice system. Now we checked in on the city's all in mile high dashboard that tracks the mayor's house 2000 initiative and so far 1512 people who were once living on the streets are now in either those rented hotels or those micro communities. We've covered those a lot over the, especially over the last few months as many we've had a lot of those homeless encampment sweeps. A lot of those people being moved to those uh, hotels or micro communities with an average individual staying in those locations for about 104 days total. But the good news and what the push the mayor has been trying to be been doing with this House 2000 initiative is get people in permanent housing. And according to the city's website, about 30 percent of people that are in those hotels or micro communities have now found permanent housing. And I imagine this apartment complex is going to be part of all of that and just getting people back on their feet and in, into work and then back into permanent housing as well. That groundbreaking is expected for 10 a.m. this morning. Of course, we'll bring it to you live here on Fox 31. But for now, live in Denver, Courtney from Fox 31. All right.